The Restaurant at the End of the Universe by Douglas Adams. Chapter 27 I trust you had a pleasant meal, said Zani Woot to Zaphod and Trillian as they rematerialized on the bridge of the starship Heart of Gold and lay a planting on the floor. Zaphod opened some eyes and glowered at him. You! he spat. He staggered to his feet and stomped off to find a chair to slump into. He found one and slumped into it. I have programmed the computer with the improbability coordinates pertinent to our journey, said Zani Woop. We will arrive there very shortly. Meanwhile, why don't you relax and prepare yourself for the meeting? Zaphod said nothing. He got up again and marched over to a small cabinet from which he pulled a bottle of old junk spirit. He took a long pull at it. And when all this is done, said Zaphod savagely, it's done, all right. I'm free to go and do what the hell I like and lie on beaches and stuff. Depends what transpires from the meeting, said Zani Whoop. Zaphod, who is this man? said Trillian shakily, wobbling to her feet. What's he doing here? Why is he on our ship? He's a very stupid man, said Zaphod, who wants to meet the man who rules the universe. Oh said Trillian, taking the bottle from Zaphod and helping herself. A social climber? 